powwow. Heard the word? Been to one? They're amazing to participate in and to witness, but do you know how they actually started and what they're like today? I'm here to fill you in, so come along with me. This is Kayan Explains Powwow Culture. Powwows are an important part of life for many indigenous people. They involve gathering to honor traditions with celebrations, songs, dances, and so much more. It's important to me too, so keep watching while I get ready for a pow, and wait till the end for the final reveal. Here's me putting on the actual dress, where every jingle on the dress represents a good thought and a prayer. If you've ever gone to a pow, you're probably familiar with the bright colors, and the sound of jingle dresses, and the food, and the drum groups, and the unique vendors, and the singers. And I mean, I could just go on forever, but just listen. Do you know that this kind of joy wasn't always allowed to happen here in Canada? Take a look at this, section three of the Indian Act in 1884. It was illegal for indigenous people to gather in ceremony or celebration. And even non-indigenous people who helped or set up a gathering could be jailed. Many traditions were lost during this time, as generations had to hide their culture for fear of punishment. This ban on celebrations and gatherings changed over time, but basically lasted for more than 60 years up until 1951. So how did we go from secret gatherings to the big celebratory powers we have today? Some experts point to the Wild West shows of the early 20th century as one possible turning point. There, you can see me putting on my dentalium breastplate, and here, I'm putting on these gorgeous, huge quilled earrings. Things started to shift in the early 1960s and 70s. The ceremonial bans were lifted, and indigenous people began to celebrate their cultures openly. This meant combining the celebratory elements of many First Nations, like the Cree, Blackfoot, Ojibwe, Dakota, and many others, into one gathering, the powwow. This shift can be described as a cultural reclamation. Reclamation is when you recover something that was once yours. Many youth are taking up the powwow practices that their parents and their grandparents weren't able to do. There's my mom putting in my plumes, and we wear eagle feathers because he's the animal that flies closest to our creator. And now, powwows are growing and evolving. According to powwows.com, there are more than 190 powwows happening across North America this year. Two of the largest powwows in North America are Gathering of Nations, which is in the U.S. state of New Mexico, and Manitowabe in Winnipeg, Manitoba. It takes me about an hour to get braided up, painted up, and dressed up. Thousands of indigenous people all across North America attend these events. Pow culture and celebrations today are a combination of many things, and not all of them are the same, just like not all First Nations are the same. Cultural customs will differ depending on where you are and who is hosting the powwow. There are some basic elements you can find at many of them, like Grand Entry. It's the official opening of a powwow, like this one from Gathering of Nations 2023. Dances like Men's Traditional, Women's Fancy, and Jingle, that's me. Drum and songs, like these from the Aboriginal Awareness Week Calgary powwow traditional regalia. Some pieces with beadwork can take dozens of hours to make and weigh 10 pounds, 50 pounds, or even more. And food and vendors. If you go, be sure to try an Indian taco. Like these, from last year's North American Indigenous Games in Halifax. As powwows grow and expand, more people can be included. This year, St. John, New Brunswick is planning their very first powwow. And powwows for the Two-Spirit community are becoming more and more popular. And if youth like you and me continue to take up the practice, who knows where the Pow Trail will lead us next. All right, here it is. The full contemporary jingle dress outfit. That's it for CBC Kids News. I'm Sophia Smoke, and I hope to see you out on the Pow Circle. <laughs>